This video shows an alternate solution to lesson three, practice exercise D. Everything is the same in this version down until line 16. On that line, I use make feature layer to create a feature layer containing just the target city. I give that feature layer object a name of city layer. Then on line 17, I create another feature layer, this one of all the park and ride facilities. In this line, I only pass in two parameters because I want all of the park and rides. So I'm not gonna pass in any type of query string here. With those two layers created, I can now do a select layer by location so that I can get just the park and rides that fall within the selected city. So in this use of the tool, the inputs I'm supplying are strings that are the names that I assigned to the feature layer objects, park and ride layer and city layer. That's instead of a feature layer held in the variable and the name of a feature class as I did it in the first solution. So coming into line 20, park and ride layer refers to all 365 park and ride features. Then after line 20, it refers to just the eight features that fall within the boundaries of Federal Way. I then insert the name of that layer, park and ride layer, into a call to the copy features tool and then finish up by cleaning up the two feature layers.